Hey, hello, welcome back. In this video, we will see how to make this kind of glitch text effect in Adobe Premiere Pro. At the end of this video, you will get the free glitch presets. You can use them in your videos or photos or text also. You can download them from the link in the description. Now let's move to the tutorial. You need some text first to create this glitch effect. Now go to the effects and search for color balance RGB and drop it to your text layer. Now make two copies of this layer. Now select the first clip and go to the effect controls. Inside color balance, set the green and blue to zero and change the blend mode from normal to screen. Now select the second layer and this time change the red and blue to zero. Again change the blend mode to screen and select the bottom layer and set the red and green to zero. Now you don't need to change its blend mode. Now select the first layer and move your player head to one second. Now give a keyframe to the position and move 5 frames ahead. And change the position of text to left or right. Like this. Now again move 5 frames ahead and reset the position value. Now let's play. Now you got your small and simple glitch effect. Now you can add some variations to the glitch by animating the scale and rotation. Go to the first frame and give a keyframe to scale and rotation. Now move 5 frames ahead and change the scale to 105 and rotation to 5 degree. Now again move 5 frames ahead and reset the boot scale and rotation. And let's play. Now you got your simple glitch effect within just few minutes. Now you can just copy those keyframes and paste them where you want. And you can also make the variation by using the position, scale and rotation. Now select all these layers, right click and nest. Now move to one second and apply a cut for 15 frames. Now go to the effects and search for wave warp. And drop this effect to those 15 frames. Now change the wave type from sine to square. Now set the wave height to 10 and wave width to 350. And set the direction to 0 and play the video. It looks perfect. Now you can play with the values to add some more effect. And if you are lazy to do all this stuff, you can download those free glitch presets from the link in the description. You can also use them on your videos or JPEGs. You just need to cut the part where you want this effect and drop the preset on that part. This preset works best between 10 to 15 frames, so keep these in mind. And play the video. And you got a cool glitch effect within a few seconds. So use these effects in your video and don't forget to share this with your friends. So this is it for today. Subscribe to my channel for more videos like this and see you soon in the next video.